Jack O'Brien is a three-time Tony Award-winning director. He doesn't do tours. The Rodgers and Hammerstein people come to me and say, there's this national tour being done. Would I be interested? And I did thought, no, I don't think so. And then they said, you can do anything you want to. And I started to read the piece. And you know, it was written by Howard Lindsay and Russell Krauss, who were bona fide playwrights. And we all know that the Rodgers and Hammerstein canon have really amazingly well-written stories. Jack O'Brien is not just a very great director. He's also a great director of Shakespeare. And he has approached The Sound of Music with the same seriousness, the same curiosity, the same respect that he would a play by Shakespeare. Because it was so well directed, we did allow something good from the movie to be put into this production. And suddenly in the rehearsal room in New York, when we got to something good, it felt as if the lyrics didn't really say enough. We're really trying to deepen the romance and as well as the political and social commentary of this show. In his early career, Jack O'Brien was a lyricist. So we allowed him the freedom of examining the lyrics and something good to see if there, there might not be some, some changes. So Jack, as he said, took out his rusty pen and has given us a great new set of lyrics. I'm doing a little pumice work on it. I'm just sort of getting the rough edges off and we're, we're experimenting. We're having a nice time with it. Imbues the evening with such vitality and such honesty. It's magic on stage. Mm -hmm.